Hi, I'm going to be talking today about the Skullcandy H2 wireless headphones. I've been using these headphones for about one year and I think they've held up great in that time. The question is, can you use these headphones in 2019, 2020 and are they a good buy for their price? So the first thing is the looks and I think these headphones look amazing. I really do think that these headphones look better than many other headphones that are much more expensive such as the Sony MDRs and the XBTs. The thing is, even though it's so big and bulky, uh, it's actually quite light. And uh, that also brings me to my next point. They're all really comfy. These headphones, I've used this for hours. I think as PC headphones, they're really good, like for just watching movies and playing games. However, eventually they do get a little bit uncomfy as the rubber pads sort of uh, brush around the skin. Of the benefits of being a Bluetooth wireless headphone, which are many, it's really useful. The sound is okay. There's a low bass, it's very smooth, it's not as sharp as other headphones, but it's there. It may be that you find the sound fairly casual and just not entertaining enough. I would agree. It can, this headphone can be loud, but the truth is it doesn't do enough to distinguish the sounds. And so it does have a not very good, quite budget oriented quality to the sound. And you might find these headphones more useful as sort of a backup headphone, PC leisure. I've used these at the gym before, they're okay. So the question is how do they do in 2019? The H2s were around 60 to 80 pounds when they were released to brand new around 2017. And today you can find them for around 30 to 40 pounds used and higher if you still want them new. The new H3s may be better in sound, but according to many reviews, they're not as comfortable as the H2s and that's why many people still would prefer the H2s if I'm not wrong. There is a lot of competition and this is probably the biggest down factor of the H2s in 2019. You can find headphones on Amazon for around £40 which are just simply better in quality. They have better features, better battery life, comfier and they just have better sound, better bass, clearer pitch. So overall, I think the Hesh 2s honestly are not a good buy in 2019. They're comfy, they look amazing, but the sound isn't very good and that's the main drawback. The truth is, in 2019, if you go on Amazon, eBay, you can find lots of brand new headphones with features that are just better than the Hesh 2s. We're talking better sound, better battery life, and they're comfier, and that's all that matters. So if you still want to buy Hesh 2s, Go ahead, they're great headphones for 30 40 pounds. They look amazing, they do feel kind of premium other than the sound, and I'm sure you enjoy them. But honestly, I would look at cheaper, maybe unbranded alternatives on Amazon. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more videos soon.